Hi there ladies, the name is here. Thank you so much for tuning in. So in today's episode, I brought back my friend Ram. Thank you, yeah. Uh, so I've picked out uh, five fragrances from uh, my collection, some perfumes. We're gonna get Ram to smell it, tell us what he thinks he's smelling, it. radium from one to 10. So the first one I'm gonna start off with is uh, by Carolina Herrera, and that is called Good Girl. It's a little bit intense in the okay. beginning, yeah, so like there's a lot of... There's lots going on, this, yeah. fragrance, this yes. perfume has lots of going on in the top, the mid, the base. But yeah, it, I mean it's good, Yeah, but probably a 7 for seven, now. 7, 7. Do you like it? Do you smell this on a girl? Do you enjoy smelling this? A girl walks by you wearing good girl, is she going to get your attention? I think it will get my attention, but... It, it's not it's not gonna be like in a in a wow way it just okay like, it's not it's gonna not, wow you okay yeah it's just like a fragrance yeah okay. like somebody's it's wearing perfume a okay yeah. but it's good yeah let, let's do a seven seven excellent okay next we have a lady fabulous by Puck Rabanne there we go Ram is very fascinated with these bottles right yeah, I, I think I like this better than the. Good you girl. like, you like this this lady million. It's a lady fabulous. I'll probably give it an eight. An eight. Yes. Yeah. Okay. There. So next uh, perfume I have is by Dior, Poison Girl, or the Toilette concentration. So we had a good girl. We had a fabulous girl. Or <laughs> yeah, <laughs> lady, <laughs> lady, girl? yeah, lady. So it is a little bit intense. Okay. Not not by much, just a little bit. Is it like sweet orange? Is, I'm not sure what I'm thinking. Okay, so you 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 think you're smelling citrus? A little bit. Not, some not like the freshness. Yeah, of fruitiness. A you get some fruitiness in it. Yeah, like very sweet, like fruit or what? orange. Okay. Orange peel. Okay, okay, zesty. Something zesty. Yes, but not in a fresh way, in a more oh. deeper way. And yeah. deeper, okay. Okay, gotcha. We think this wows you, this is something that gets guys' attention? Yes, yes. So, so it, it is, it's not like entirely unique, uh, but I would ask like, that. that's a good fragrance, like what are you wearing? Yeah, so. So what would you rate this one? I, I, I would give it an eight as well. Eight, Yeah. excellent. Yeah. Okay, so the next perfume I chose is by the House of Dolce and Gabbana. This is called The Only One Two. So there's flowers. Okay, you get yeah. some florals, okay. Yeah. Probably the first uh, spray is, yeah, there's like a punch to it. So I'm not okay, picking up. Okay, in your face. Yeah, I'm not picking up a lot of deeper notes. Yeah, just florals at the beginning. And what, do you, what kind of age group do you think this is good for, you think? Maybe someone in their 30s. Yeah. It's okay, a bit 30 more. and above is a little bit more mature. Yes, yeah, exactly. Yeah, but I think so far this is the more mature. So, what would you rate this one? For now, probably a seven. A seven? Yes. Okay, there we go. So, the last one I chose by the House of Chanel. This is a popular one Coco Mademoiselle, the Eau de Parfum. This is the intense version. Yeah, it's really intense, actually. Mm -hmm. And what would you rate this one from 1 to 10? An 8. Yeah, An it's, eight. It, it's a bit unique. So, yeah, if you if you wear this, yeah, it's, it's a bit unique. I feel like, yeah, this is more of an evening fragrance. Yes, yeah. And I feel like it's for some people who are 30 and up, because uh, anything young, it's not youthful. It's not youthful, yeah. Definitely. It's not youthful, yes. something for a classy, a special occasion. Mm -hmm. I see this wearing, but you could also wear it at whatever evening you want, go for a dinner or whatever. But this one's, yeah. Yeah, so it's more, uh, it projects more than, I feel like, a little bit of the other yeah, one. Yeah, it, good, good, uh, it has good projection. So what would you rate this one from one to 10? I would give it a nine. Nine? Yes. Wow. Yeah. There we go. So the first fragrance that we're gonna smell the dry down is by Carolina Herrera, Good Girl. We give this one a seven. Okay. Let's see if the Good Girl got bad or something. <laughs> I think it got better. 
Okay. Yeah. So it smells more mature now. So would you rate this up higher? Yes. So it's a seven. Maybe we'll do an eight. An eight. Okay, sure. Okay, next one we have Lady Million. You give this one an eight. I would keep it an eight. Yeah. Keep it an eight. It didn't change much. It just got softer. The little okay, bit. lighter. Okay, so we're going to keep this an eight. So next one we have Poison Girl by Dior. Christian Dior. So this one doesn't have a lot of complexity as the other ones. It smells really good. So it's more playful. Yes. Yeah. Playful. Yeah, we'll do 8.5. 8.5. I feel like there is one note and sugar. Okay. It's like a sweet flower, let's say. Okay. Yes. Yeah. So next we have uh, from Dolce and Gabbana's The Only One Two. Now it's a bit more floral. Okay. Yeah. Yeah, it smells good. Um, I would give this a um, a more, sorry, like an older age range. Than okay, so it's more mature for an older crowd? Yes. Yeah. Okay. Uh, maybe a 7.5. 7.5. So last we have a Coco Mademoiselle, the intense version. Yeah, it's still, it's still good. It's got better? I would keep it the same. Okay. At, at a nine. Okay, so we just keep it a nine then. It's more unique, but it smells good. Yeah, okay. it smells good. Excellent. So there we have it. We have our winner is Coco Mademoiselle, uh, the intense version. I would perform intense. Yeah. There we go, Ram. Thank you for coming on the show. It was Thank great you. having you. Well, hopefully we'll have you back on the show soon again. So my pleasure. Yeah. Thank you. Write down in the comment section, anything you like about regarding these perfumes or any other perfumes you like just to engage with the communities and also for me to know what's what you like the best or what fragrances do you like me perfume me like me to review for you. Thank you so much for watching. Take care. Peace.